Steve Harvey can't believe some of these answers on Family Feud. Wait. I love I love Family Feud videos. Let's see what this video is. Four answers on the board. Name something Abraham Lincoln probably used to ride on. Delaney. A horse. A horse. He probably did ride on a horse. Hooray! <laughs> Spins. <laughs> Carriage. Okay. Eric, tell me something that you know for a fact. <laughs> Abraham Lincoln used to ride on. Maybe a donkey. Good answer. Good answer. Good answer, Eric. You Why fucking dumbass. Somebody come riding in on a donkey. <laughs> Donkey? Oh. Bridget, only one strike. Name something Abraham Lincoln probably used to ride on. I don't think they had the bicycle back then, but maybe, maybe. A bike? A bicycle. Wait, what did they ride in back in the day? Horses and carriages. What else did they ride in? Strikes, we gotta be careful. If it's there, we're still alive, sir. But if it's not there, the other family can steal and win. Oh, a train. The train. Oh, yeah. good answer, Alan. The train. Good answer. Okay. Delaney, we have one answer left. Delaney, if you give me that answer, your family wins the game. This time you have two strikes. If it's not there, the other family can steal. A casket? Isn't that the same thing as a carriage, though? Name something Abraham Lincoln probably used to ride on. Miss Lincoln. <laughs> Whoa! 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 <laughs> Um. Um. Four game. Been one of the nicest squares families I've ever met. All of a sudden, game four. <laughs> riding in on donkeys. And now he's riding Miss Lincoln. <laughs> um. Oh my God! Riding on that thing, Miss Lincoln got. Oh my god. No way. No way that's a fucking answer, dude. No way. You think Lincoln was a fucking freaky bitch back in the day? Oh, he was a freaky motherfucker. Top six answers on the board. Name something starting with the letter K. Oh my god. Ketamine. Kite. Name something starting with the letter K that a wife might do to her husband. Kick him. Kick him. No, I would not kick my Well, husband. that's what you said. <laughs> kick him. We're gonna play, Steve. Play, play, play. We're gonna play, Steve. We're gonna play. Kill. Whoa. Whoa, you guys are menaces, man. Hey, Chris, name something starting with the letter K that a wife might do to her husband. I would say kill. Maybe kill him. Yeah. Oh, hopefully not, Chris. <laughs> K, divorce and take the kids. Something starting with the letter K that a wife might do to her husband. Oh, I think I did. Kiss. I think I did see that in your butt, like where uh, one of the cast members actually was like a fucking murderer or something. Yeah, I, I saw something about that. Aww. Yep, you're drawing a blank now, buddy. <laughs> Name something starting with the letter K that a wife might do to her husband. Neil? Um. Okay. Let's see it. It's there. It's got to be 
Oh, we all want to see it. But... Oh. I can promise you it ain't going to be up there. That's just wishful thinking, Spencer. Neil. I can't think of anything else. Name something starting with the letter K that a wife might do to her husband. She wants to keep him. Keep him? Yeah. Keep him? That's why they're married, right? Oh. What? Sarah, name something starting with the letter K that a wife might do to her husband. Be kind to Be him. Be kind. I don't know about that. Two strikes now, Chris. We got to be careful. The Janice family can steal. Give me something starting with a K that a wife does to her husband. Um, put ketchup on him. I don't know. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Put ketchup on him. You gotta answer, Chris. You fucking idiot. Starting with the letter. Yeah, K knock him up. Might do to her husband. Knock out. Knock out. Yeah. <laughs> Knock his ass out, man. This guy, Dev, doesn't have a wife. What? Top six answers on the board. If you could sell it and make a lot of money. Oh, shit. Tell me a body part you'd be okay living with just one of. Sherry. Arm. One arm. One wow. Arm. <laughs> one arm. <laughs> One hand. One hand. What? Is she stupid? Uh, Doc. Kidney. Steve. Oh my god, that guy's sweating. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Troy? If you could sell it and make a lot of money, tell me a body part you'd be okay living with just one of. Steve, we're gonna go ahead and go with an ear. One ear, oh, yeah. Yeah. Hey, let me ask you a question, Troy. I say, if... would you give up that ear for a million? Right now, you can have it. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Eyebrow. <laughs> I don't think you could sell your this eyebrow. Change my kid's life. Larry, if you could sell it and make a lot of money, tell me a body part you'd be okay living with just one of. Lungs. One lung. Yes. Good answer. Yes, good answer. Good answer. A lung. Um, is that even possible? That's an interesting question, though, man. It really is. Big Will, if you could sell it and make a lot of money, Probably a tell ball, me a yeah. body part you'd be okay living with just one of. Um, for a hundred million, you can have one of these eyes. <laughs> <laughs> I'll put a patch on it. <laughs> Give me a patch and a hundred million. <laughs> Dig it right out. Mm -hmm. One eye. It's got to be balls. Chef, we got two strikes. Our Guayos family could steal. If you could sell it, make a lot of money. Tell me. What, what is this going to do? <laughs> Nostril. A what? What? A nostril? <laughs> you can sell it, and make a lot of money. Tell me a body part you'd be okay living with just one of. I don't have one of these, but my family said testicle. What? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's it would still work. I would still work. What? Frisco, I'm so. You came out of that huddle with four women and said testicle. They made you say that, man. Man, damn, I don't even care. Testicle <laughs> hell. It's gotta be up there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay, that's too that's that's too much. Number 5. A boob. Mm, how about that? Mm. <laughs> shut up. Shut up. Four. I would say that too. 3. Oh. Top 4 answers on the board. We asked 100 women. 
There's no second date if a man says, oh, by the way, I have a what? A wife? Chris. Wife. Yeah. A wife. Yeah. Sugar mama. All right, come on. Addiction to Genshin Impact. Talk to 100 women. There's no second date if a man says, oh, by the way, I have a what? A VD disease. I have a VD disease. Wait, what does that mean? This ain't my Aunt Bridget right here. Wait, what's a VD disease? You got the VD disease, that's it. What, what is that? Your ass, mister. The VD disease. Wait, what? Oh, STD? All right, here we go. Uh, oh. Kira, darling. We ask 100 women, there's no second date if a man says, oh, by the way, I have a what? Multiple kids. Ooh, I have good multiple answer. kids. Good answer. Good answer. Good answer. Yeah. Good answer. Good answer. I don't think I'd want to do Danielle, date somebody with the kids. Is there, your family wins the game. If it's not there, you're still alive. No strikes. We ask 100 women. There's no second date if a man says, oh, by the way, I have a what? I have a... <laughs> she was so confident in that man <laughs> she was she was so confident in that answer <laughs> Steve <laughs> there? you know I'm not dating you again if you I got a raid shadow legend sponsorship. Call. Sean, one answer left. If it's there, oh, criminal record would be game. good. If it's not there, you're still alive. That's a good answer. Strike. 100 women. There's no second date if a man says, oh, by the way, I have a what? A boyfriend, Steve. Oh. Whoa. Great answer. Great answer. Great answer. Great answer. Whoa. For the win. Okay, I was, I was going to say. That's homophobic. That was a really good answer. No, it wasn't, Steve. That'll, that'll end it. Well, we got one answer left now, Miss Crystal. If it's there, your family wins the game, but this time you have two strikes. If it's not there, the other family can steal, and they will win the game. Crystal, talk to 100 women. What's she going to say? What a dipper. Says, oh, by the way, I have a what? A small penis, Steve. <laughs> 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 Good answer. Good answer. Ah. Uh, uh, Ramos, it's good to see you, man. Well, here's the situation. We have one answer and one answer only. If it's there, your family steals. Your family wins this game. But if it's not there, the other family wins the game. Oh, shit. It's very intense. Here we go. We asked 100 women. There's no second date if a man says, oh, by the way, I have a what? A record. I have a record. That makes sense. Oh, what? What else is it gonna be? Number four. Your ass on YouTube. What? <laughs> what? Is this like a giant outro? Why is there like it's four minutes left? So you're telling me you would not date somebody because they have you know good old Fido over there, you know? What is it? A pet. What's wrong with a pet? Like, yeah, we can't go on another date because you have a dog, or you have a cat, or you have a fish. What? Depends what animal. I mean, yeah, if it's like a fucking, like, cougar, or like a... like a tiger. The whole damn family gonna be on YouTube. This oh, there's like an outro.
Top four. It's like an outro, even though it's not the end of the video. Answers on the board. Name a job where you're handling people's packages all day. Oh. I'm UPS driver. UPS driver. Yeah, they forgot to cut it. Yeah, I, I can do it. The four foot jumps let me know we was playing. <laughs> Big Nate, name a job where you're handling people's packages all day. I'm gonna say a nurse. <laughs> That's actually a good answer. <laughs> what? How is that not on there? Name a job where you're handling people's packages all day long. I am going to say Santa. Good answer. That's a smart answer. Yeah, that's smart. Santa. What? Well, that was a good answer. All right, now we got. Uh, I don't know, a post office worker. If it's there, you guys are still alive. But if it's not there, the other family can steal and win. Leo. I don't know, she said UPS driver, so I don't know, like, how broad that is. Uh, I'm gonna go with prostitute again. <laughs> prostitute again? <laughs> again? I didn't have an answer. I love this boy. I love this boy right here. I know nothing about that, by the way. I'm gonna I'm gonna out that is the biggest cap. Boy, two of your answers has been prostitutes. <laughs> <laughs> See, when you're 23, you're going to work it back around to that some kind of way. It's a good answer. Steve. I don't care what the question would have been, he's going to find a way to do it. What's a high paying position? Prostitution? <laughs> the guy from the Lorax? I got three answers on the board. You give me any one of those answers, your family steals, your family wins the game. If it's not there, the other family wins the game. Simple as that. Name a job. Let's see. Be handling people's packages all day long. We're going to go with a gift wrapper, Steve. I mean, that makes sense. This is for the win. A gift wrapper. Okay. I want to know the other answers. Number four. Three. Oh, is that it? Oh, that's it. I mean, I guess a prostitute and a porn star is not the same thing, but they do the same stuff. It's just one's not on camera. And in front of people, in front of people, so uh, I don't know. I mean, I guess they're not the same thing, but uh, you don't know that for sure. Well, I, I, I guess. Yeah, one's legal and one's not. I don't know. Interesting. Leave a like and subscribe.